Hello, Cancer. Welcome back to Visions of Light and Love. This will be part two of your reading. I'm sorry there was an interruption. Um, but this reading is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the week of June 2nd to June 8th. I am going to continue with your clarifying your reading now. So, um... I was saying someone was um, going inward because they wanted to, they wanted happiness. Could be a Leo. And it could be with an Aquarius or they were hoping or healing from a situation. But let's, let's find out. Because I don't see anything in the past energy. Stating that this person, you or this person, um, went through anything yet. So with the Four of Cups being here, someone could be bored in a situation, but they're not taking this cup of love right now. Could be because they're working hard on something. Someone could be working hard right now. But they're not hoping for this situation they're not, they're not working, wait a minute, they're working hard, they're working, so maybe that's not why they're not taking this cup of love, but maybe they lost hope in the situation, could be because they feel restricted with the eight of swords, they may feel restricted in the situation, so they may not be moving forward. They may be stuck. Things could be stagnant at this time. Because we have the nine of wands, the knight of wands in reverse. So this person isn't moving. They can't move right now. They feel restricted. Someone is feeling restricted at this time because they're not even moving. But, but someone wants a new beginning. And they want a new beginning. With this queen of wands. Whomever this queen of wands is. That's fire energy. Or they're, they're, they want a new beginning. And they're going to take action. To have a wish fulfillment. I'm sorry. To have a wish fulfillment. With their counterpart. Which is the king of wands. As I said. This, is, this could be. Um, a long term relationship. A marriage. But someone wants a new beginning. And and they're in this king and this queen and this king are facing each other. They have the same energy. They both have the same energy. So someone is going to have a wish fulfillment with this other person. Because they're they're taking action to move forward for this ace with for this ace of cups for this new beginning and love. With it has its stability there, and they're just waiting. That's why this three of wands came out again. This person is just waiting to take action to communicate with this other person, and they may, with the will of fortune, they may travel to this person. They may, um, because the eight of wands represents movement too. So this someone is moving, moving towards someone. Could be because they were in some type of conflict or something with the five of wands. Could have been some type of conflict going on. Maybe mental conflict. If not um, arguing and fighting with someone. So they want to take action and move towards some someone. Someone is moving, taking action to move towards someone. They're thinking about how they can do it. All right, Cancer, let's see what your, what your love oracle cards are. Spirit, can I have a love oracle card for the sign of Cancer? Can I have a love? Okay. We have mirror. Could be mirroring each other's energy. Mirroring each other's energy. Self-image relationships reflects our wounds. Introspection. So someone definitely is thinking about a relationship you two could be someone you two could be thinking about each other remember 
this could be you or your partner but someone is someone is thinking about moving towards something someone is thinking about moving towards something or someone spirit what message do you have for the sign of cancer what message do you have for the sign of cancer too many cards What message do you have for the sign of cancer? What do you want cancer to know for this upcoming week? I like the cards to fall out. I don't like to pull them out. I want spirit to be in full control of the, the readings. Spirit, what message do you have for the sign of cancer? Okay, I see the line. It says angels. So cancer, your guardian angels could be um, protecting you at this time. They, You may need to seek your, um, answers, like go inward, meditate to get answers from your guardian angels, your ancestors. But um, yeah, this is the end of your reading. If this reading resonates with your situation, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'm sending you lots of love, light, peace, and healing energy. Um, sending it to you as well as your family and into the world. Be safe out there. Um, try to stay in good energy. Around positive energy. Um... Thank you for watching. I will see you next time. Try to enjoy this week. Bye.